this for you. Jason Richards from the Bristol Gym taking on proud Welshman Ian Tompkinson over three two-minute rounds. Let me remind you of Muay Thai under European rules. Kicks allowed to the head. Kicks allowed to the inside and the outside of the legs. Knees and elbows are allowed to the body only. No spinning back is allowed and the three knockdown rule applies. For us here tonight, Ian Tompkinson from Wales, 27 years of age. Eight wins and four losses. He's the current BTB Five Nations champions with two successful defences. His opponent, Jason Richards, 18 years of age. He's also had 12 fights. And he has been the WNTO junior British champion and currently is the WMTO English middleweight champion. The two men, Ian Tompkinson, 27 years, looks a, a hard man. You look at Jason, he's, he's a bit baby-faced. He's 18 years of age. Yeah, I mean, uh, Ian, is it, is it Ian his name, sorry? Yeah. Round he, one. He looks a very rugged fighter. And you can see straight to work. Very strong, very strong with it. Yes, Ian Tompkinson straight away coming out. Heavy hooks to the body, digging his head in there, hooks, round kicks, legs, blistering start from Ian. It's a very, he? very strong start, start and fantastic body shots as well. I think Jason is pacing this out, but um, uh, Ian has to watch, he doesn't blow his stuff out in his first few seconds. Yes, but Jason he, he Richards took that well here, came back sharply, tucked in neatly. It certainly didn't intimidate the young man, is he? Absolutely. I think Ian has come out to actually dominate this fight from the word go. He's come out very strong. Jason is, come, is actually meeting it pound for pound now. Yes, to me it looked like Tompkinson came out to say, look, it's a man versus a boy. Absolutely. But Jason took it all calmly and then came back. And even now, a lot of those heavy hooks are on the arms and gloves. It's exactly. That's what we've had, a fantastic knee that just followed through there. But that's what you've got to watch, actually. These, those shots from, from Ian at the beginning were not landing. They were uh, being taken on the gloves by Jason. See, Jason it looks baby-faced, but he's showing his experience. He's not... Oh, fantastic. big right kick there. Fantastic. Tompkinson all over the place. Just as you said that, is he? A big right kick. It was a fantastic... Straight to the head. Fanta as I said to you at the beginning, uh, Jason has got a fantastic left kick. And, a, and this was actually a right kick. This is not This is not his good kick, believe it or not. But well, it's a Ian fantastic... Tompkinson, he's telling us he's all right, but he certainly doesn't look it to me. And I think he's got some further punishment to come straight to the same place with that kick and it, suddenly the whole shape of this fight has changed is it this fight is actually coming to light now it, was, it just shows jason's experience he didn't blow it in the first few seconds and he's now actually dominating the fight now with fantastic right kicks to the head and, and again another one, that's the third right kick in the row to tompkinson's head and yet funnily enough it all started from a vicious low kick not a high kick it suddenly stopped tompkinson in his tracks and then from there, Jason went to work, so that did all the damage was the low kick to start. You see, J you see, Jason's actually trying to work the body, start from the low kick and build to the head. What would you be telling the Welsh boy Ian now, taking three thunderous kicks like that? I would be telling the Welsh corner now to really watch out for those kicks. Um, from a distance... Because I think we're going to see one of them here Seconds now, is away. Because it was a perfect kick. <laughs> he bounced it in. And you can see it was straight over the guard at the top of the head, and that can actually knock you straight out. Uh, for, you know, it was good for Ian to actually keep his wits about him. Well, Ian Tompkinson tried to assert round his authority two. right at the beginning of the round. He's had a rude awakening now, and he knows exactly the job that's up for now, doesn't Ab he? Absolutely, absolutely. This is, this is really warming up to be a very good fight. Some fantastic technique coming through here as well. So here we go, Jason Richards, the explosive young fighter. Taken the sting out of Ian Tompkinson, who, to his credit, keeps driving forward. But he doesn't seem to be able to find a way through. And then he's faced with the incredible accuracy of Richards. I think this is, a, this is what's telling the difference here. I mean, Ian is throwing a lot of le leather, but Jason is actually connecting. And that's the difference between the two. Jason is, is, is blocking the move, but he's so quick, he's catching Ian in every move. That's right, Ian Tompkinson, his hands just aren't high enough. Jason whips that leg over the top and it's landing on the face. And you really do feel this isn't going five rounds. I, I think what we need to watch as well is, is, the, is the low kicks that Jason's putting here. These low kicks are actually having an effect. He's moving it from the leg to the head. Well, at the moment, is he? He's landing at will. He works the outside of the leg, the inside of the leg. Ian's staggering now. This is all over as far as I'm I tell you, this, this will stop soon now. The leg kicks is actually making all the difference. See, the leg kicks is actually going to stop Ian from actually moving. He won't be able to walk after this round. I mean, fair play to the young man. Very strong upper body. Still digging in, but he must be so frustrated. I think Ian's going... These are hard shots. I mean, and they're doing nothing. 
it's, it, Ian's going to overdrive. Ian is actually a very, very strong chap for him to keep going after those kicks. It just shows you the determination and the mental attitude for the sport. Yes, all credit to him. He's come back strongly. He's tried his best, but inside and outside of his legs have been worked mercilessly. And I think by if he survives this round, he's going to find round three and four very torturous. What will happen now is that uh, uh, once the bell goes, Ian will sit down and he will to stand up. That's, he will feel it as soon as he sits down. Yes, Jason Richards, relentless working these legs. But fair play to Tompkinson. He's a strong boy, is he? Ian is a very strong chap, very determined, and will not go down. But well, this is the problem for Tompkinson. These are so accurate. And he works the outside, the ins there was the inside of the leg, but he works the outside as well, the knees, the thighs. Then he brings it up to the head. Just where do you defend with this boy, is he? It's incredible. It's incredible. See, with Jason, he's actually, he's confusing the chap. He's not making the chap, uh, Ian, to think that he will just go for low kicks. He will mix it from the low and he will mix it back up to the head. And so therefore, Ian is thinking to himself, where Super do I block away. next? Absolutely superb roundhouse straight to the head there. Let's see what Ian Tompkins has got left in those legs for the third round. Superbly game, lad. Throwing leather all the time. I mean, Ian, Ian obviously has to now come out and knock Jason. He has to knock Jason out to win because he's now behind. The problem is we haven't seen a shot get through to make Jason see stars the way Ian has. And this Nothing tells, has landed cleanly. It just shows the superior skill of, of Jason. He's got fantastic skill, but he's got superb defense with us. Yes, Tompkinson game, forcing what? the pace a lot. But as soon as he's finished, he really gets punished. This is the technique of an all-round fighter. Brilliant defense and fantastic inside and outside work. Slight marking though on Jason's right eye. To be fair, Tompkinson has kept up a brilliant pace considering the pressure he's been under. Uh, it just shows the mental attitude. He has really come prepared for this fight. He's come prepared not to go down at anything. Again, that was a superb inside kick there. crunch there from that leg kick. We heard this clearly. Even with our speakers on our ears, we could hear that clapping. I mean, these guys are gladiators. They really are gladiators. They take so much punishment and with that positive attitude will not go down. Oh, he took an uppercut there as well, Tompkinson. Suddenly Richard shows another string to his bow, catches his man flush. Uh, I honestly get the feeling, Izzy, that for a slight period, Tompkinson has gone through that pain barrier. You've been there as a fighter. Exactly. He's, oh, he's, he's gone, gone that. He's gone now. now. He's gone Just that. as I was saying, he went through it, the eyes went, didn't they? Jason got, J uh, Ian got caught with a superb kick to the head again. But it just shows you Jason is an all-round fighter. Superb handwork, superb footwork, superb inside as well. And Jason, Ian cannot go. Quite fairly, I feel. A wise stoppage, I think, by the referee there. I think it was wise to stop Ian at, the, at this stage. He was taking too much, and really, he could he could really get hurt if they continue the fight any further. But let's put this in perspective. Watch it. If we watch the slow mo, is he? Let's put this in perspective. Against a lesser fight. Tompkinson would be a real handful. Absolutely. Very strong chap this year in, in Thompson, but Jason was just a class act tonight. As you can see, uh, we're going to show the knockout here. He's just waiting his time, isn't he? A, fa a, fake, jab, a fake jab and a superb, over, a superb right kick to the head there. But he'd fake that. He'd fake that with a jab first and follow through with a superb right kick. This kick, I mean, it doesn't get much better than this. It comes right Abs over the guard. And in Thai boxing, what really does the damage is not the, the instep, it's actually the shin. And you can see it was the shin that connected to the side of the jaw. That's what actually does the damage. Well, after 1 minute 53 seconds of the third round, the referee stopped the contest in favour of the blue corner, Jason Richards. Now is the 